Today, I want to show you how great design can give people superpowers. But to truly appreciate great design, let's start with an example of not so great design. This machine in Stockholm does just one thing. It sells you a train ticket to the airport. But look at how complicated <laughs> it is. Yeah, seriously. Why do we build such confusing objects that enfeeble, infuriate, and frustrate us when we have the potential to make things that empower, amuse, and delight? This machine in Oslo does exactly the same thing. But just look at how different it is. To buy a train ticket to the airport, I simply take my credit card, I swipe it through this machine, and I walk on the train. And do you know what this machine makes me feel like? It makes me feel like Superman. <laughs> I just walk up to it, swipe my card, and I walk on the train. That's amazing. That's great design. Great design empowers, amuses, and delights. It makes the technology invisible and the experience indistinguishable from magic. I call this the Superman effect. And this month, in under 24 hours, I created a demonstration of the Superman effect at a hack day in Cannes. And it subsequently won the hack day. It's called Grab Magic, and I want to show it to you now. So, Imagine that you're sitting at home in, on your couch and you're watching television. Now, that screen over there is my TV screen, and this small screen over here is showing you what's on the screen of my phone. So I'm just going to wave at my TV so that it knows that I'm here. So I'm going to say, hi, TV, I'm here. And when something interesting comes on, I just reach out and I hold it in my hand and I transfer it to my phone. And then <laughs> I can share it with my friends. For example, I can tweet it. So it's that simple. Let me show it to you again. There's something interesting. I reach out and I grab it and boom. Or sometimes it doesn't work so well. So let me just do that again. We can edit that bit out too. So I'm just going to say, hi TV, I'm here. How are you? And there's something interesting. I reach out, I grab it, I hold it in my hand, and boom, it's on my phone. That is magic. Let me show you how it works. So connected to my television is an Xbox Connect, this thing. And among other sensors, it has a depth sensing camera that can see in three dimensions. So this is what my Kinect sees. This is what my television is seeing. There I am. When I wave my hand at it, it knows that I'm there, and it can start tracking my hand. And when I put my hand towards the screen, when I reach forward, that's what it has, that's what it registers as a grab. And then it tells my phone wirelessly which frame, which image was grabbed. From there on, <laughs> Thank you. From there on, my phone is just waiting for that tap. When I tap it, it shows me the image that was grabbed. As a whole, it's a seamless, natural interface. I just reach forward, grab what I want, and I transfer it to my phone. It feels like magic. It feels like I have a superpower. And that is the power that we have as designers. The power to change the world and improve people's lives by making things that give them superpowers. Things that empower, amuse, and delight. Things that make the technology invisible and create experiences that are indistinguishable from magic. Thank you. <laughs>